Hi, it's Tom from Green Shorts, and today I want to show you a simple way to increase the efficiency of your rocket stove by adding a fan. Stay tuned. Welcome back, subscribers. If you haven't joined us yet, you can do so by clicking on the Green Shorts icon that's going to appear in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen throughout the video. You may have noticed from my previous rocket stove videos, I'm either blowing on the fire or fanning it to get it to burn hot enough. I wanted to try and increase the efficiency of my rocket stove by using this simple fan that I got from Goal Zero. It's like 12 bucks, got it from REI, it's an online only product. And I'm powering it with a little battery extender that I got from my iPhone. I'm gonna complete my blower assembly by using this section of gutter. I'll use that to capture air, put the fan on this end, and blow it out the other end at the base of the fire. I'm gonna keep the length on this gutter piece because I wanna have enough air volume being pushed by the fan using some snips. I'm gonna reduce the circumference of this end to increase the rate of flow as the air comes out the end of this downspout. This aluminum is pretty sharp, so I'm gonna put on some gloves to do the forming part. Cut this a little bit more. Once I've got this reduced down, I'm going to strap it down with some duct tape. I'm also going to put some duct tape along this seam to prevent air from escaping here. With my gloves back on, I'm going to round the shape of the end of the downspout just so it is a better match for the shape of the fan. I made a little base to hold the fan and allow the gutter to sit here to keep it off the ground a little bit. And I'm going to strap this down with a couple of rubber bands. Both my components are created, now let's start the fire. All right, now let's start the blower. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get the pot on. One simple way to shorten your boil time, set your pot of water in the sun for a few minutes and let the sun warm it up. So watch what happens when I turn the fan off. Still a respectable burn, but slows down a great deal. Turn it back on. Let's keep this thing fueled up. So a rocket stove is already green, but this makes it greener because we're adding oxygen to the burn. It's gonna create a hotter, cleaner burn. And one added benefit is that I'm using a solar panel to charge up my battery extender, so I'm using solar power to power the fan.
A few more minutes and there's an egg salad sandwich with my name on it. One full charge of my battery extender is powering the fan more than enough to get all the way through this boil. That's a nice fire. I love using my rocket stove because it allows me to replace cooking gas or electricity with fuel that I found right here in my backyard, sticks and twigs, and that makes it sustainable. And I've made the process all the more efficient by using a $12 fan, a $10 battery, and a piece of reclaimed gutter. You can find links to these items in the description below. If you haven't seen the DIY video where I make this rocket stove, you can check it out by clicking on the card at the top of the screen or the annotation. As always, our mission here at Green Shorts is to help you see green so you can be green and save a little green by doing it yourself. Thanks for watching. Please like and share and subscribe for new DIY videos every Friday.